exciting times ahead. Been like a little boy waiting like Father Christmas, waiting for Father Christmas, waiting for the Zoic, Zoic Paleotech Father Christmas to turn up. Looking out the window, waiting for him to come up the drive. He's finally here. So many fossils, I'm gonna have to do it. I've bit the bullet and bought a load of prep tools. So a little different video today, a little unboxing video. See what we've got. Got pretty much everything I need to set up here. Bought all this lot from Zoic Paleotech. Let's get this big heavy one out of the way, so I pretty much know what this is. So we'll save that for last. Try and make a bit of room. Always struggle for room in here. Gonna have to start keeping it tidy now. All right, let's see what's in the box. pumping what's in the box. I've been wanting to get prep tools for a long, long time. But we're gonna have to now, I've got too much stuff, we need to get rid of it. So I will be selling some soon. Ooh, what's in the box? Come and have a look. Got some airline, airline ready for the air tools. What's what's hiding in here? What tools have we got? Some fittings for something. Couple of screws. Well packaged. Need something to put that lot in. Use this packaging quality. This will come in handy. Ooh, what is it? Nicely well packaged. I bought all four of these boxes from Zoic Paleotech. Got some excellent air equipment coming up somewhere.
Wow, look at that. That's some awesome bit of kit. So here we've got the uh, air filtration thing, sucks out with the water, moisture trap. We've got the uh, blast cabinet set up now, so we don't want any, any moisture getting into our tools. Wicked, and it's only because put this regulator on for me. That saved me having to do it. Thank you very much. Right. We're all so hopefully in this box. All my fossil prepping dreams will be coming true. What's in the box? Handy little measuring cards. Sweet, there's a couple of these. These can come in quite handy. Nice bit of marketing there for Zoic. If they're anything like their uh, tungsten tips I've used on the engraver, they're gonna be amazing. So a good buy engraver. I can finally blow the dust out the way and see what I'm doing. Sweet, always needing a pen. Gotta love it when you get freebies, isn't ya? I can go up there. This is some tips for the uh, air abrasives. Ooh, what's under the orange? Again, well packaged. Oh, I can see something. What's in there? And a baggy as well. Sweet, more freebies. Another bag of goodies. And another little parcel. <coughs> So that's a spare tank for air abrasives. So this is a spare tank for the air abrasive unit that'll be coming out of the box soon. Because we'll be using a
Looks a decent bit of kit, nice and sturdy. Easy release, easy plug in. I can't wait to get the rest of the unit out and see what that's like. Ooh, we need to get into those really, don't we? Let's see what's in the bag. Let's see what's in the goodie bag. Nice little box. This is the one, the T-Rex. I've been wanting this tool since I've seen it, probably about five years ago, I don't know, it feels like forever. Let's see what's inside. Some instructions, I might actually read these for a change. Seeing as I have no clue what I'm doing. I've had a little go on prep tools, uh, air tools. They're good, but this thing should be the beast. The T-Rex. Raise a fair bit. Always aiming the knife away from yourself. coming. This one's got a cat. I ain't my cat. <laughs> wow, look at that beast. I'm not going to get into getting this all out properly. I think I'll do that. This beast and the next beast their own unboxing videos but yeah looks like a decent bit of kit look at that point comes with some spares what's next what's in here Here we have the Micro Raptor. T-Rex is good for the big bulky stuff. Also supposed to be good for fine work, but this one is the one for your fine work. Definitely for our lobsters and Desia sites are quite delicate. Wrapped up well again. They do a good job there at Soic. Love the presentation box. And the orange crepe paper, nice and organic. Or maybe not organic, but a bit more eco-friendly. Whoa, look at that beast. Pointy bad boy. This is the Micro Raptor. Prepping some nice delicate fossils with that. Finishing off the centers on the ammonites. Yeah. Again, I'll do a, probably do another little video just for the Micro Raptor once we've got everything set up. 
Yeah, beautiful. Can't wait to get everything going. So the next box, pretty much think I know what's in there. Been a few hints and tips on what's in, on the way. So after we finish with the Micro Raptor, I'll be wanting to finish off So it's, yeah, to finish off, to get that last bit of matrix off your fossils, to get that real nice professional finish, you need to air abrasives. And really delicate fossils, you can use the air abrasives. Cautiously as well. I've had a little dabble into air abrasives as well. They're yeah, definitely worth it. Good looking bit of kit too, that isn't it? So you whoop your air abrasive powders into there. Get in your blast cabinet, get the fans going. And this foot pedal turns it on and off. And uh, hopefully it should be good for these lobsters, clean out that last bit of dust in there and stuff. So look forward to setting that up. So the last two boxes are for the air brazer. Oh caramba, got some iron powder. Soft and a hard one. I got some more powder at a friend's house, need to go and get that later. There's lots of different types of abrasives. Oh. If you've watched along this far in the video, thank you for watching. Uh, if you're not subscribed, thank, please subscribe. And thank you to all my subscribers. We'll do a few more fossil prep videos for you soon. Fossil season is on its way, so there won't be. This is to uh, sift your abrasive powders before you put them in. And if you recycle it, I've got a recycler, so you can recycle and get all the stuff out and use it again. So yeah, thanks for watching. This has been a little unboxing video. I wanna get on it now, I wanna get everything set up. Might do another little video while I'm doing that. I don't really know what I'm doing, but we'll give it a go. Hopefully it won't be long, we'll be on it. So uh, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. And thank you to all my uh, subscribers for commenting and everything. Send us a comment. Uh, see you soon. So here we have it. We've got our dropout air filter. 
remove all the moisture, moisture trap. And there, got a pneumatic splitter that's so it kindly already bolted up and connected up for me. Uh, got the T-Rex. We've got the Micro Raptor here. The Pro Blast air abrasive unit. Spare tank for the iron powder and a sieve for sieving the powders. Got a little goodies there. There's our iron powder. Uh, thanks for watching. Thanks to all the subscribers for subscribing and commenting and everything. Exciting times. More prep videos coming. Fossil season is coming soon as well, so uh, try and make a balance of prep and fossil hunting videos. So, thanks for watching. We're back soon putting all this together.